everyone. Uh, before I start, I just wanted to congratulate all the channel who have passed stage one. This is a small presentation in which I'll be telling you what we'll be doing in stage two, because a lot of parents have asked us about what we will be doing in stage two intensive course. So these, this is a small video which will explain you everything, what we'll be doing in stage two. So let's get started. So basically the course will cover, you know that Southern stage two only have maths and English. It doesn't have any comprehension. So we'll be co covering the advanced maths problem solving skills. We'll be telling you how to solve problems and we won't be doing like papers because some providers you think will be just doing papers after papers because this is not the time to do papers with your children. We would be basically covering the things which are more advanced like the math skills. And we'll be telling them techniques, how to solve math problems. And we will be also doing a creative writing, a food, uh, sorry, a full feedback would be given to them throughout the program for the creative writing. So we'll be covering some topics of the creative writing, what we think they'll be getting from the past papers also we'll have, we also have a view from the past papers. So in maths, these are some of the questions which I feel like the channel should be doing because some of the channel parents I have been, I'm getting a lot of calls from the parents. They keep telling me that our channel are really good in maths, but we only want the course for creative writing. Maths is something you can not do it yourself sometimes because there are really hard questions in maths, which are there in stage two. And sometimes you need extra help to do these questions. So if you look at the questions, what I have on the screen, these are some type of questions which would be there in stage two. You won't be having a simple math problems like what is mode, what is medium and what's the end term. Questions will not be like that. They should be, question would be there in which your child would be doing all the working out. So basically the maths won't be multiple choice. It will be a standard choice maths in which they have to show their working out and then find the answer. But as I told in my earlier videos also that your children will not be marked for the working out. They will be only marked for the right answer. But still it's recommended that your child should practice how to do working out in maths problems to find. Because if you look at the problem, which is on the screen, which I've shared with you guys, then this problem, you have to do the working out. You can't just do it in your mind and just write down the answer. So it's always recommended to do the problems write it down, do the working out and write the answer. And we will also be working to tell the children how to split the problem in two, three parts, two, three points, and then go with the working out, how to work out the question. So this, this, this course is really beneficial if your boy or your girl does that. Now, if you look at the creative writing, Creative writing, it's normally, it's not like the basic way, creative writing, what do you have? They really want to see how your skills are. They have started doing creative writing recently. They never used to have creative, they, they used to have creative writing with the comprehension, but only creative writing is done for almost two, three years back. They have started doing that. In this, they want to see the language body your child is using the vocabulary, the punctuations, all these things are very important in creative writing because remember that they don't have comprehension. So they will be marking the creative writing. And if there is a tie, they'll be looking at your creative writing. So this is something I have just taken some points of creative writing, the type you might be able to do it because we'll be working with all these creative writing skills, what we think your child need to be working for. So if you look at this one, it's a normal creative writing I've taken from a private school paper. And this, the second one we have made ourselves. So there is creative writing in which will be made from private, will be taken from any private school paper, or it's good to practice that. So if you look at that, they might tell you that if you look at this one, they say that write about the time when you went for an important journey. In your response, you might want to conclude where you traveled to and why. Highlights of the journey and anything which made it chill. The last impact, if any of this journey had on you. So basically, it won't be something like you say, like basic one. You, you might have creative writing, like writer writing, letter writing. 
or you would have like continue the story we won't have that because you don't have comprehension so it cannot be like continue the story things like that so this is something which will be in your creative writing and it'll be something different it will be something related to what's going around you so it's better to if you child don't like reading newspaper it's better to start reading newspaper at least for this a week if your child has a week if your girl doesn't i know girls have the entrance on saturday so they don't have a week to do that and next thing now how the course is structured so basically the intensive course for the boys is for 2 weeks so you can select from any of these 2 weeks it's 26 27 september and 3rd october so you could just book any one week or you could book any both the weeks it's up to you and second to fourth october and the time we have taken is 5 to 7 because your child will come home they need to come home rest and then get ready for the course and the best thing about this course is that you don't have to come to us it's online you can just do the course anywhere but we always recommend where you doing the course because it's online it should be a quiet place and the siblings and anyone else should not be in the same room with the, with your child your child should be absolutely alone while doing the course they should think like they are in school and the surrounding should be absolutely quiet so they they can concentrate what the course is giving them and the venue is obviously is the al platform and the price is 150 pounds for the boys because it's 3 days for the boys i'm telling you a one week uh, price if you want to buy both the weeks there will be a discount which will be putting will be putting in our website today in the evening so if you want to have two weeks you'll be getting a discount for doing two weeks and because the girls have less time it's uh, only two days for the girls starting from tomorrow 26 to 27 september and the time for the girls we have taken is 5 to 7 same because we want them to come home rest and then do uh, the course themselves and it's 100 pounds and all the material of the course is included and the only thing you all have to do is the material will be given to you on the day of the of the class at least 2 3 hours before because i don't want the children to look what they are doing before entering the online classroom so all the material will be provided but you have to print the thing out you need to have a good print out to print whatever they are doing and where you can book the course obviously you can book the course from alt website and you if you want to pay by child care vouchers you should just contact the company just email us at info@missionslearningtuition.co.uk and then we will be able to sort that out so remember that we have added some dates because some of the boys parents wanted to do two weeks course instead of one week so we have added two weeks one and i'm sure you that we have really good feedbacks if you go and look at alt website or you look at the advertisement what we doing on facebook we have got really good feedbacks for our course because we don't only work with your child but we make sure that your child pass the entrance so you could go on our website and just book the course and that's all for this video because it was, it was a small presentation which i wanted to show you and that's all for today and i hope to see your children in the course if you're doing that just try booking it as fast as possible because we have limited spaces i don't like taking 100 channel to do a particular course we are limited we only take limited channel maximum would be 10 or 11 in a course so if you think your child 